Hey guys, the Ford Granada had a lovely day on Friday collecting a couple of superb Fords. The uh, Cortina we've just done, 9,000 mile Cortina, and then a 28, I think it's 28,000 mile Granada here. 29,000 now, oh, it's high miles. You know our stance on mileage, so as I said when I was doing the Cortina, common sense has got to prevail. Um, and I think common sense suggested it's going to be right. In fact, as I mentioned when I was doing the Cortina, it's such a small world, isn't it? I reversed the lorry down here, went and got the lorry from the farm this morning, reversed the lorry down into the, uh, into the estate here to unload. And the first person I met was a guy that used to own this Granada a few years ago. <laughs> uh, and a chap who I recognise and whose opinion I uh, value. And I said, is it as nice as it appears? It looked a really nice car with a bit of time around it on, on, uh, on uh, last Friday, Friday before the weekend. And he said, yeah. He said, I, uh, I actually recommissioned the car, he said, about three years ago. Um, he said, and supplied it to this gentleman. He said, did, you, did it come from down country and he has a, you know, had a nice collection of Fords? I said, yeah. And uh, he said, yeah, he knows his cars. So just, just have a little bit of a change of direction. So there she is. So again, the Cortina, which I've just videoed, surely must be one of the best on the market today. Must be. Where do you find a where do you find a two litre gear Cortina done nine thousand miles? Uh, and then we've got the Granada. A very unusual car, nice car. We've done the, quite a fair bit of filming with it. It was lovely to be able to add to the filming the gentleman this morning. Look at that. Yeah, come on, look at that. Um, who owned the car previously. But she's lovely, all the grain's nice on the steering wheel, the pedals are lovely, the door cards are lovely, the dash is lovely, the car is lovely. So if you want, like I say, one of the best Granadas available today, then I feel, my thoughts are, we've brought it to you here, here it is, look at that, look at the tyre, look at the wheel, look at the wheel, tyre, never been on, jack there, never been out, yeah. Boot floor, like the Cortina, the boot floor is as good as the, most cars' bonnet. Two eight injection gear, and my father, I can remember when I was a kid, there was a couple of little dings there. Look at that, just a couple of little dings. Never noticed them the other day. It was very sunny. A couple of little minor little dings just there. I would imagine half of that touch up would actually come off with a bit of wet and dry. I bet only I bet what's left will be the smallest of little dings. Um, yeah, my father, like I said, yeah. He had all the professionals cars at the same time, the Granada, the Capri and the RS2000. Yeah, and I used to go in and drool over them. But there isn't really, I don't think a great deal a need for me to do much in the way of a video for this and the Cortina. You can shut the bonnet down, down the jack if you don't mind. Um, they sort of speak for themselves. Again, look at the tires. I mean the pattern and the make. I mean, that's what I mean, factory specification. The car is just lovely. What a lovely, lovely car. Well, I think we pulled it out of the bag again, this sale. We've got some real nice examples of different cars coming through. And it's lovely to be able to bring them to the market, something as nice as that. It's the sort of stock dealers would absolutely die for. Lovely bit of kit. Come down, please have a look. See for yourself.